check out what I got today. These are cloth socks. This is meant for you to use it on your mobile devices like a phone or tablet. But I intend to use these on D-pads because I play a lot of fighting games. And after a while I would get blisters and whatnot. So hopefully these will make it a little easier on my thumb when I use D-pads. <laughs> I actually never knew these existed. Okay, yeah, these fit pretty well. Hmm, interesting. Ooh, huh. So these socks make sliding around the D-pad a lot easier. There's a lot less friction. Huh. I'm not sure about the buttons though. You know, I think an ideal way to do it is probably just use it on your thumb. Yeah, I, I can see myself playing like this. You see here, there's some friction, right? Yeah, it's just the natural friction of your skin. You see how the fingerprint pattern on your skin kind of causes a natural friction? You see how it's not as easy for me to slide around with just my bare thumb. But playing with your bare thumb, you can feel the buttons better, right? Now with this guy on, it's a very smooth and slippery experience. You lose a little bit of the feel for the buttons, but what you gain is the ability to slide around the D-pad a lot smoother and easier. I'm not sure if these socks will really even help with your blistering problems on your thumb. I think they do, because they feel softer. Alright, let's try this out on my iPad mini here. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh, what's that? Oh, shit, shit. Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, so this thing works pretty well on the touchscreen, as advertised. So if you've ever used the new Hori Commander Octa controller, you know that the D-pad is really sticky. Check this out. You see how my finger doesn't slide smoothly over the surface? Instead it makes these sudden stops, right? That's because the surface of this D-pad is too grippy, right? And to do circular motion, that is so hard to do on this D-pad. Alright, now, let's put the sock on and see how it feels like. Oh man, you see now I'm able to glide through the D-pad, no problem at all. Alright, what do you say we try this in-game? Alright, here we are. So let's try the circular motions. Oh man! Wow. You know this thumb sleeves really makes doing circular motions so much easier on this D-pad. What you do gain in terms of your ability to do circular motions, you do lose a little bit of a feel to the D-pad, but I imagine that you'll get used to it over time. Alright, let's see if we can get into a match here. <laughs> oh yeah, rematches decline. <laughs> I guess he's afraid that this thumb sleeve is too powerful. <laughs> yeah, with this thumb sleeve, I'm able to do all the moves that I'm used to. However, when you do circular motions, for example, maybe you're doing a circular motions backward like this, your thumb tends to kind of slide and fly off the D-pad. 
Also, when you hit the edges of the D-pad, right, your thumb kind of slide off them a lot easier as well. You see that? Because it's so smooth now. But again, I think this is something you'll get used to. Yeah, so my final thought is if you have a controller with a really sticky D-pad or a really rough D-pad and you want it to be a lot smoother, I highly recommend getting one of these. I'll put a link to this guy in the description. Alright guys, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. See what I did there. Subscribe for more and take care now.